Hello everyone, welcome to the topic on modulus. In this video, we are going to learn about modulus of elasticity or Young's modulus, modulus of rigidity, and bulk modulus. First, Young's modulus, or modulus of elasticity, it denoted by capital letter E. The Young's modulus, E, is a property of the material that tells us how easily it can stretch and deform. It is defined as the ratio between the longitudinal stress to longitudinal strain. Young's modulus measures the stiffness of the material. If a material having larger Young's modulus, it will offer more resistant to deform. In stress, strain curve, the slope shows the Young's modulus. That is, Young's modulus is the ratio between longitudinal stress to longitudinal strain. The unit of Young's modulus is Newton per square millimeter. Next, shear modulus, or modulus of rigidity. The shear modulus, G, is the ratio of shear stress to the shear strain of specified material. Shear modulus measures the shear stiffness, or rigidity of the material. Shear modulus explains materials, resistance to deformation and transfer direction. The shear modulus is the ratio between shear stress to shear strain. The unit of the modulus of rigidity, Newton per square millimeter. Next, bulk modulus. The bulk modulus is the proportion of volumetric stress to the volumetric strain of specified material. Bulk modulus measures the amount of compression on a material or fluid under a given amount of external pressure. If a material having high compressibility, it has low bulk modulus. If a material having low compressibility, it has high bulk modulus. The bulk modulus is the ratio between direct stress or volumetric stress to volumetric strain. Compressibility is the inverse of bulk modulus. When a material is subjected to tensile load, compressive load, shear load, or volumetric load, these kinds of modulus will be considered. Now let's see the relationship between modulus of elasticity or Young's modulus, modulus of rigidity, and bulk modulus. Relationship between Young's modulus, E, and shear modulus, G, that is, E, equal, 2, G, into, 1, plus, mu. Relationship between Young's modulus, E, and bulk modulus, K, E, equal, 3, K, into, 1, minus, 2, mu. Now, the relationship between, E, G, and, K, E, equal, 9, G, K, divided by, 3K, plus, G. Okay guys, thank you.